Oh, I'm on the edge of a little village called Clunes. Looking at the nightcap range over there. Somewhere up that way is a place called Federal. And I was there a few weeks ago with Wifey in the Ute. And we got detoured because of a, a road closure. And part of the way back was quite a cool dirt road, I thought. And I thought, must go back there on the bike. Because I do need more local dirt roads so I can keep my network going. When I've only got time for a small ride, it's good to have this network of dirt roads. As without them, I probably wouldn't go out locally at all. You know, I've done the main roads to death. I love finding new dirt roads. So let's go have a look at this one. <laughs> up with this road which is called Mackie Road which I am familiar with uh, a couple of kilometers down here I think is where it joined up I think it's just after this bridge Possibly to the right. That car is going up there, so give me a bit of time to get away. This is where we're going. Um, <laughs> still missed what it's called. Over there, have a look. Ridgewood Road, that's the one. Ridgewood Road. really badly. Came up behind the car just as I hit the dirt. Yeah, lots of 
puddles uh, not the best light with all this double light This is where I joined the dirt coming off the road to the right. Just be a, what to say that way, Rosebank. I think this is just a normal road. I can't even see what this is. I think it's a tar road with lots of holes. There it is. I mean, that was good, but uh, I mean, maybe it would have been better without that car. But maybe I'll go back and do it the other way, hey? Eh? Try that. Let's try it in the other direction. Decide whether I include this Ridgewood Road in my network of local dirt roads. This would fit in with a few others. You can't see the potholes. Which were pretty severe. visibility thing is really putting me off it's like the opposite of what Alan and I had up on top of the range a beautiful great dirt road long vision good light you can see what was coming very easily Driveways, which means there's a you know a chance that somebody's going to come along here, a local. Oh, hello, bush turkey. <laughs> Off you go, go on. Oh, goodness sake. Just change the gear again, I'll just rev it out in a second. It's just too often. Oh bugger. Go on then. Okay. Assessment. Not a great road. A little bit dangerous because of the narrowness, the light, potholes. It's actually, you know, it's good fun to ride in a, in a technique sort of way. Good little bit of practice. 
even this pitch would be the best. The uh, double blade, all that carry on. You know, bends like this, it's so likely to see a ute come around just hugging your side of the road for no reason other than they're a moron, but anyway, there's plenty of them. Oh well, a little bit of exploring. Hope you enjoyed coming with me. I reckon that's it. And, uh, thanks for watching. Hopefully catch you on the next one. In the meantime, you know what it is. Be safe, be happy folks. Cheers, people.